about. They're, they're less intelligent than I thought. In the drawer, but I know enough to know. If you're gonna be dumb, you gotta be tough. You're still blowing people up. As if life's not. I'm just gonna jump right into it. So, uh, Steve, what's more special about this one? And does it hurt more doing it now at this age? Um, you know, at this age, we definitely get hurt more easily. Bones break more easily. It takes less to knock us completely unconscious. Um, so I think the result is really a good movie. You know, we've got a lot of concussions. We've got a lot of broken bones. And um, what's special about this movie, other than that... It's just so damn good, man. I don't think we could ever do anything to beat Jackass number two from 2006. That was our masterpiece. But this is definitely so much better than Jackass 3D. I mean, I love this movie, man. Me too. And it's a masterpiece, too. There could be more than one masterpiece. Well, there you go, man. Thank you. Yeah. Hey. Hell yeah, bro. Thank you. <laughs> we, we, man, how about for you? I mean, how was like after the wedgies and all this at this age, does it, does it hurt more for you, of course? Or? Yeah, the pain is a little longer, like Steve-O said. But pain is temporary. Film is forever. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> you got to always remember that. Yeah. Yep. Right. And Chris, for you, what makes you kind of go on to the next one and be like, oh, okay, I'll do it again. I'll, I'll, give me another, like, what, what, what's in you that, is it for the movie? You can't say no. Oh, making these movies is the funnest thing in the world to me. And I think, I think for all of us, like, in being together, like, in just the, I mean, to have this kind of chemistry between such a group of people is so special. And it would be just such a, a crime to not make it, this movie, like, um, and I'm so I'm just so stoked that Knoxville called us and and asked us to make it. And uh, yeah. I think the world it couldn't have been a better at a better time. It's almost like it's destiny or something. The wor the yeah. world kn knew what was going to happen, and the world blessed us to do another movie to bring it to them. Yeah, trouble was coming. Yeah, but we were there to meet it. Yep. 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 Hey, so what was going through your guys' heads when Johnny went went through this the, the flip and was snoring? Man, what was what was like? What was it? What was going through your head? Horrified. It was. It was bad. We did. I didn't want to be there and to witness it. No. Was worse than what it is. It's like okay, you've done bulls so many times. How many times right. are you gonna roll the dice yeah. with bulls? And this one was probably one of the worst. And this one was by far, by yeah. far the worst. Yeah. These, and not even uh, just out of bulls. I think it was by far the. I mean, dude, it was just bad. Yeah. Man. He had a brain yeah. hemorrhage, dude. He had a broken rib, broken wrist, like yeah, not good stuff, mm -hmm. man. And uh, yeah, I know what I was thinking was that from the looks of the way he landed, it didn't seem that he would be paralyzed from it. And yeah, the snoring, I was just like, oh god, man, just wake up and just please don't do this anymore. Yeah. If there's one kind of type of stuff that we dread doing, I think it's bulls. It's bulls. Bulls suck. Yeah. When you guys watch yourself, isn't it different to see like when you eat it or the pain? You're like, oh, you, do you jump again and feel it again when you watch it? No, think, no, watching it is totally different. It's more than like doing it. Yeah, if you see yeah. it, you more get stoked in the sense yeah, of pride. Yeah, yeah. Like, okay, I know how I lived through that. Yeah, yeah, and it makes you better for it. Yeah, I don't mind seeing my own injuries, but if it's like a really grievous injury, like a bone breaking really yeah, badly, I, I don't like that. to. I don't see like that. that either. Some people do, but yeah, no. Do you guys, do you guys ever get back at? It seems like nobody gets back at Johnny. I mean, Jasper got back at at, at Tremaine. Right, but no one gets back at, at Johnny. Kinda. I did a little bit. Johnny hit me in the nuts this time, and I was holding the ramp up, and I was just like, "Screw you!" And I slammed the ramp back on him. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. How great was that fire extinguisher when Danger Aaron goes to get, get it, and it yeah. just backfires on him. And then he said he purposely did it. <laughs> God. Damn. You guys think Johnny will do one more? You think he'll do one last one in ten years? Like the um, I, I don't I, think he won't. 
After the first three movies. I, after each of the first three movies, Knoxville said that that was the last, that there would never be another one. And as I understand it, this is the very first Jackass movie after which he's not said that. But what he did say is that he's not going to risk his life for any more movies. So from that, I think we could infer that it would be less than 10 years until the next one. Yeah. It's like Vegas. Stop while you're ahead, you guys. You guys have done a miraculous (laughs) job. That's exactly what I was saying, man. When I found out Knoxville wanted to do a new movie, I thought, dude, like, after what we've gotten away with, after what we've survived, after what we've built, to go and do another one, all it takes is one incident, one accident, one injury to just erase this whole beautiful legacy. And we're also taking the chance of not making like something worthy. But we got lucky, we got away with everything, and we made something that is not only worthy, but like I really believe a masterpiece. Yeah. I totally proud. agree. All masterpieces, perfect. You guys killed it. And thank you for talking to me, man. Thank hey, you. Thank for you, having you bro.